Yeah, my name is uh, Joe Fodile. I'm a pastor in Kent, England. And um, the, the apostles was 100% right with the prophecy. And um, actually what surprised me was the, he went to the root of my problem, which I was too surprised. He called my, my village, my town, he called where I'm coming from. And I know he has never been to <laughs> my village, so I was so really surprised by found God. And um, share with us some of the prophecies. As you already quoted some, the one thing that you know it was happening in your life and it spoke exactly. Uh, the one that shook me and I still felt, he said I was supposed to take a title mm. and I rejected it for God. Mm. That is 100% correct. Mm. Actually, I am the next in line to take title in my uh, family. And when I was told, I refused. I said, I'm no more um, into tradition. I want, I'm serving God, so anybody can take it over. I didn't know it was a problem. I, and then um, it has been the thing, according to apostles, that has been pursuing me around because I refused to take that title. So that was one of the um, prophecies that, uh, and it's, from the thing is the foundation of my problem but, and I thank God for it and at that particular moment when he told you the things that are really happening in your life without you sharing them to him how did you feel um, I was shocked mm -hmm. the, like I said the one that was most shocking was when he started telling me uh, my town you know I know he has never been to my town I know and even what surprised me, he even called the name very well. He didn't, um, you know, there are certain times you call names, you'll be, uh, oh, 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 he just called it Onicha. I was surprised, and um, I thank God for that. He prayed for you. How did you feel at that moment? Oh, it was wonderful. It was wonderful. And then when we finished, I found, I found myself so tired, so exhausted. I couldn't believe it, and I thank God for it. as I believe that God has done it for you. Words of encouragement to the viewers? Um, to be honest with you, I will advise everybody to make a, a effort to be here. And um, because 
the, you need to know the directions. It's not only just um, praying and praying and praying. Uh, what you know, when you're pointed to the right direction, your prayers will be faster and easily to be heard. So now I've they've dealt with my the foundation of my problem. I will still come back to give testimonies of what the Lord has done in my ministry, in my business, in my life, in my family, uh, in Jesus' name. We give glory to Jesus for life. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you.